Hey everybody, welcome back. So today I'm doing a uh, Alright, so here we are on the asset drop box project, the the um, Lady Dorothy Quimbley. Have her all primed in black. I'm gonna start with the base coat of the coat d'arms brick red. I'm just gonna try and do a even base coat on this, maybe a couple coats. So after the base coat is dried, I'm gonna do a mix of three drops of brick red to one drop of vampire red mix and uh, dilute it just a little bit. So basically what we're going to do here is we're going to take this mixture and cover up a lot of the dress. There's going to be some brick red exposed but it's going to be in the deeper right recesses and as we continue to go brighter on our highlights it's going to become more narrow where we paint. Alright, so we're going to go one step higher on this highlight. We're going to go two drops of the brick red to two drops of the vampire red. And uh, go a little bit more narrow on the coverage area. So once we're about done with this coat, we're going to go with a mixture of three drops of vampire red with one drop of brick red. And just keep gradually building that up. So now we are into just straight vampire red. And then we'll go with uh, three drops of vampire red and one drop of blood red. And just keep building. Same, same applies with this one. The next step from there we'll go a 50-50 mix of vampire red and blood red and start gradually taking the vampire red out of it to where it's just pure blood red mix or not mix just pure blood red and every layer I go over I'm painting less area than I did before trying to get that that uh fade to look nice and natural you still want to have contrast to it but you want that blend to look good so here I skipped ahead to where we're into the uh, just blood red by itself
all right so here's the red dress um, this was the the tutorial on the booklet from the asset dropbox again tune back in as we continue this project in later weeks like subscribe share thanks